The Insert tab has three types of breaks, page, column, and section breaks. But what do these breaks actually mean? Let's discover it in this video. Page break is useful, for example, when a chapter's title is located at the bottom of a page. To make navigation to the next text easier, you can move the heading onto Next Page. The same works if you have text arranged in several columns, such as poetry. Add a column break to bring any line to the next column and keep the prosody correct. Section break splits your document into different parts to allow different formatting in each one. For example, your document is in the portrait mode and you want to insert a table in landscape. Choose among four section break subtypes. Start a new section on a following page, on the same page, even or odd page. We'll pick the first option. Leave space for your table and insert one more section break after it. Add a table and change the layout to landscape. Now only one section changes the layout. That's how to use each type of break in only Office Docs. Subscribe for more tips on document editing.